so it just seemed ironic to us. This is where we met, and this is where we're going to be. <laughs> so, full circle, I guess. It was in 1963. We uh, were down here as counselors at church camp. This was a church camp. Nothing like what you see now. So we spent that summer. We didn't start dating until later in that year. We met at the Audley's Fair, County Fair, and uh, first she didn't like me. Hmm. He thought I was flirting. All I was doing was asking the time we were supposed to meet up to go back to Kena. And he thought I was flirting, so he just, I didn't like him at all. Went to college, out through college together, and uh, so we, that's how we really get to know each, get to know each other. other. Finally, I didn't feel he was so egotistical. Okay. There was more to him than that. <laughs> so I got to the place we thought we'd retire. We're 75 and 76. Thank you. My wife over me. <laughs> when it was time to retire, we knew of Otterbine, so we came to visit and decided to make this home. And this is really just it was perfect for us. Yeah, I mean, yeah. it just, there's night neighbors, there's friendly people, we're all about the same age, and but everybody's so friendly. I have really, really been happy with everybody says hello, everybody talks. You're not, you can't be lonely here and you can't be sad here. And you can do as much as you want or as little as you want. The past is forever gone. The future is still our own. That was kind of my theme when we graduated from high school, and that's the way we looked at it. Yeah. It's hard to get rid of so much to downsize. That we have to admit. But as I sit here, I must not miss those things so badly. Now, I have new things, and just do it, and then forget what it was, because that was, as he said, those are memories. Let's make new ones. It's time in our life to do.